Well, tonight we're remembering a Memphis teenager who was killed in a drive-by shooting. Christopher Reed Jr. was about to start college at Lemoyne Owen. Local 24's Brad Broders is here now after speaking with Reed's coach and uncle. Brad? Yeah, good evening, Richard. The shooting happened just days after Christopher Reed's 18th birthday. A crime his family said he was an unintended target in an unsolved case, causing an unexpected funeral for his family tomorrow. It kind of buckled on my knees when I got the call from his mother. That call a first for Dorsey Sims III in his 40 years as a basketball coach. He learned a drive-by shooting claimed the life of a guard on his summer travel team, Christopher Reed Jr. Very talented young man, very gifted, had a high IQ for the game, and his future was extremely bright. Authorities said Reed died moments after someone opened fire into a home of people in the 1800 block of Farrington Street in South Memphis. Bullets hit Reed inside the home. Family members say the 2018 Manassas graduate wasn't targeted. When you hear about drive-bys, you know, your heart goes out. But to have it hit so close to home and within your own personal family, it just really takes to another level. Coach Simpson and others are now raising money to help offset funeral costs for a family grieving and struggling in the aftermath of what loved ones describe as a senseless killing. People don't understand how it affects you until it hits home. And when it touches your family, when it touches your loved one. Now there'll be a visitation for Christopher Reed Jr. tonight, and the funeral is at 11 Saturday at Prince of Peace Baptist Church. If you're interested in helping Reed's family with expenses, log on to our website, localmemphis.com, and click on the green Find It tab. Reporting live in the studio, Brian Broder's Local 24 News.